This is the Holy Color Powder. Now the powder itself is non-flammable, it is easy washable, non-toxic, eco-friendly, and skin-friendly. Now the reason why we're using this is this thing itself is absolutely safe. So I have this bunch of powder right here and I got a match. No matter how hard I try to burn this thing or try to catch fire on this thing, it won't actually work. Even if I drop the whole thing, it dies out. This is a little bit stronger than the match light. The powder itself is non-flammable. Therefore, even if I try to burn with this strong fire, it won't catch any fire. However, there's only one exception. You kind of see that? It catches fire a little bit more. This is called dust explosion. Kinda. Yeah, I gotta clean this now. It is less likely to get to a skater's face height with the dust explosion. It will probably surround himself with the fire in about like 1.5 meters to 2 meters um, square. You can actually do a calculation of explosion surface, but I'm not gonna get too geeky about this stuff. Anyways, this is how the dust explosion works. There's better ex explanation on YouTube or so something, whatever. Um, you'll probably learn it in elementary school or whatever. Anyways, that's the basic idea. We're gonna put some color powder on to the skateboard and we're gonna light the whole area up and make him do a tray flip so the powder goes boom and the light should go kaboom. Concerning safety, we got a bunch of water and we got fire extinguisher and stuff so should be all right. So the reason why we're doing this is there's a thing called GoPro Million Dollar Challenge. GoPro just released Hero 9 Black. Um, when If you make into a million dollar challenge video, you get a cut of million dollars. We've seen some amazing slow-mo shots of skateboarding with color powders in the past and some fire skateboarding or surfing. So I came across with this idea of dust explosion where you pretty much mix the color powder skateboarding and the fire skateboarding. All right, we got all of our equipment ready, including this bad boy. And we got all of our color powders here. We only have like a 20 minutes of golden light time, um, starting about probably 10 minutes. Um, that's the only chance we can capture the like the flare and a little bit of the background as well. So hoping for the best. Let's get into it. Here goes nothing. You. Smells fast. <laughs> Sick. Oh, that was so close. Oh, dude, you had it. Ready? Now, when he's doing his tray flip, he literally can't see his boards because of the flares. So basically, he's doing all of this with his muscle memory. Pretty amazing. Oh. <laughs> and when you compare the one with the dust explosion and the non-dust explosion one, the non-dust explosion is a little less exciting. We don't get that flare around the board once he does the tray flip. And this is a shot where he got his shoe sole caught on fire. Just a little bit. Oh, <laughs> oh that was fucking heavy, And this is our final shot of the dust explosion skateboarding. I reckon it went pretty well. So, yes. here it is. That was the uh, behind the scenes. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, we're gonna keep stacking bangers and I hope you do too. Enjoy your rest of the day and I'll see you next time. Phew.